Hello students, how are you all? Hope you all are fine at your home. So today we will going to uh, we will start uh, practice set 1.1, question number one. Uh, so concentrate. I am reading the question. Show the following number on a number line. Draw a separate number line for each example. Here yeah, there are four example given. Okay. So one by one we will solve. First example is three upon two comma five upon two comma minus three upon two. First, we have to draw a number line. See here solution. Draw a number line. Okay. Now here uh, there are two positive rational integer and one negative na rational integer. As you know that negative rational integer always on left hand side and positive rational integer on राइट हैंड साइड इज दैट क्लियर जो नंबर राइट हैंड साइड पे होते हैं उनको हम फॉरवर्ड बोलते हैं ठीक है और जो लेफ्ट हैंड साइड पे होते हैं उनको हम बैकवर्ड बोलते हैं अब यहाँ पर देखो आप देर आर टू रैशनल पॉजिटिव रैशनल इंटीजियर एंड वन नेगेटिव रैशनल इंटीजियर वी विल पुट दिस नेगेटिव रैशनल इंटीजियर ऑन लेफ्ट हैंड साइड दैट इज माइनस थ्री अपॉन टू एंड प्लस थ्री अपॉन टू एंड प्लस फाइव अपॉन टू ऑन right hand side is that clear so first we have to make a line simple line first we have to make a line then see here denominator 2 is given that means we have to take a distance of 2 and then we have to put their number center we will put here 0 okay then right hand side forward side okay so here one leave that zero and count to one Two in the position of two, we will put there one. Okay, now leave this one. Go forward. One, two. Now in this position, we will put here two. Okay, now leave this two. Again count one, two. Now put here three. Is that clear? Same like this, we will do on left hand side. But left hand side, we will go backward. Yes. So here zero. So leave this zero. uh now backward count first 1 2 minus 1 okay on two position we will put there minus 1 now again leave this minus 1 1 2 okay now here put minus 2 now 1 2 put here minus 3 after making this number line we will we will put this number on number line okay Now this two number on right hand side. So three upon two. So here zero. Okay. So uh, leave this zero. One, two, three. Okay. After leaving this zero, we are counting one, two, three. So we will put three upon two here. This is the position of three upon two. Okay. See. Yes, three upon two. Okay. Now after that, three, four, five. Okay. Now we will put here five upon two. If three is here, then four, five, five upon two. Is that clear? Same. We will do on left hand side, negative side. So leave this zero again. Go backward and count one, two, three. So we will put minus three upon two here. Is that clear? We will put here minus three upon two. Okay. So students, this is the solution for question number one, sub question one. Uh, so solve this question in your notebook. Okay. Sub question two, seven upon five comma minus two upon five comma minus four upon five. See here, there are two negative rational integer and one positive rational integer. Is that clear? So first, we will write here solution. Okay, this is our solution slide. First, we will draw a number line. Okay, now here we will put right here solution zero. In between, we have to put here zero. Now see, distance कितने का लेंगे हम लोग? Five का distance लेंगे. क्यों? Because in denominator, uh, five is given. Okay? So the distance we will take 
is from 0 is uh, 5. So leave this 0, leave this 0 and it's going to come 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay, now on the position of 5, we will put there 1. Okay, now leave this one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now on the position of 5, we will put here 2. Is that clear? Same we will do on left hand side. That is our backward side. So, from middle 0, 1, leave this 0, but okay, don't count this 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Now put here minus 1. After drawing number line, we have to put all these three number on number line. Okay. So, 7 upon 5 is the positive rational integer. That means forward side. We will go on right hand side. Okay. So, here see. 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay. So, here we will put 7 upon 5. That is positive rational integer. 7 upon 5. Okay. Now, there are two negative rational integers, so we will move to negative side. So now, uh, don't count this zero, okay? Don't count this zero, go backward. One, two, okay, one, two. So here, two upon five is given, minus two upon five. So here, one, two. Put here, minus two upon five. Is that clear? Now, move forward. Oh, no, move backward. One. 1, 2, 3, 4. So, here we will put minus 4 upon 5. Is that clear students? Like this, we have to draw number line and we have to put all these three number on number line. We have to show this number. We have to show this number on number line. Because our question says na, that show the number, show the following number on a number line. Is that clear? So, now students, uh, you can pause the video and take the screenshot or just note down it in your maths notebook. Okay, so now let's start. Let's continue with our next question. Here, sub question 3. Minus 5 upon 8, comma, minus, see, minus 5 upon 8, comma, 11 upon 8. That means there are two rational integers are given. And here, one is positive rational integer, that is 11 upon 8. And one is negative rational integer, that is minus 5 upon 8. So, first we have to write here, solution. Okay, this is our solution board. Here we will write our solution Okay, so uh, here I am drawing number line. See, first I have to draw number line like this. Okay, center we have to put here 0. Okay, now on right hand side we will put rational integer that is 11 upon 8. And on left hand side we will put negative rational integer that is minus 5 upon 8. As I told you before that positive rational integer number are forward side and negative rational integer numbers are on left hand side. See here, don't count this 0, okay? In between we have to put here 0 and then we have to take here distance of 8. Why? Because denominator distance is 8, 8 is given. So we are taking distance 8 from this 0, okay? Now, don't count this 0 and go forward because we are going on, we are going on right hand side. Okay. So, for right hand side, we will go forward. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. See here? On 8 position, we will put 1. Okay. Now, 1, don't count this 1 again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We will put here 2. Okay. On 
8 position we will put here 2 okay now positive side is done now we will move to negative side that means yes backward side so here 0 don't count this 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 on 8 position we will put here minus 1 because it is negative side it is negative side now and left hand side so we will put here minus 1 now in front of us there are two number given minus 5 upon 8 and 11 upon 8 so minus 5 upon 8 on left hand side so here 0 1 2 3 4 5 okay so we will put 5 up minus 5 upon 8 here okay concentrate on the screen yes minus pi upon 8 here is it clear now we will so uh, we will show this 11 upon 8 on right hand side so 1 uh, leave the 0 and don't count the 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 here 11 upon 8 is that clear my students yes any doubt any difficulty okay now students are you getting now yes now listen now you can pause this video and take the screenshot of, of the sums or just note it down in your notebook okay so let's continue with the next example students now let's solve example number 4 that is 13 upon 10 comma minus 17 upon 10 now in this example one positive rational integer given and one negative rational integer given both side denominator equal that is 10 and we will take the distance from 0 uh, 10 is that clear uh, for, for each point for each point we will take distance 10 okay distance of 10 for each new points first here solution side we will draw a number line see here center 0 and from this 0 we will take distance of each for each number 10 1 2 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now here on 10 position we will put positive 1. Okay. Now leave this one and again count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Again on 10 position we will put here a new number that is 2. Okay. Here we will put 2. Same on left hand side. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. On 10 position we have put here minus 1. Now again count 1. Don't count this one. Huh? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now we will put here minus 2. Now one by one there are two rational integers are given. One is positive, one is negative. We will show these two rational integers on number line. So 13 upon 10 that is positive rational integer which is on right hand side. So here 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, 12, 13. Here we will put 13 upon 10. Is that clear students? Here we will put 13 upon 10. Positive side, right hand side. Yes, here 13 upon 10. Is that clear? Yes. Now same, we will do on left hand side. Minus 17 upon 10. So here 0. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 
14, 15, 16 and here 17. So 17 upon 10. Is it clear? So here we will show this 17 upon 10. First draw number line. Then give the distance of 10, 10. Okay. On each point 1, 2, 1, 2, positive 2 and negative 2. Okay. Now in this way we solve our sum number 4 and other sums. Is that clear? So students just note down the sums in your maths notebook. Okay. Just pause the video and write the sums, solve the sums in your maths notebook or any notebook which you want.